Okay, I had said that I would uh, do flip throughs of completed journals so you could see what they were. And this is my July journal. Nice linen. And it is by smartplanner.co, which I love. I really do. I think it's 140, 160 pound paper, GSM pound paper, made of bamboo. It's awesome. It's my mom, my brother, and my daughter. Its name is Navigator. It was my July. Here is my key. Yes, my July journal. Sorry. Bullet codes, color codes, which I never actually put in place, but I had it written down if I wanted to. Um, you can see lots of washi tape to mark different pages, different events. And index. And this is the one that I, I, I will never, ever, ever buy a used journal from an Amazon again, at, from the Amazon uh, marketplace. You know, it was cheaper. And I, at the time I was buying this, the normal price was $14.99 and this one was like $9. And I had had mixed results buying other journals and it's an A5, so it's it's nothing special. But, you know, I live with a Scotsman and try and save money. That's about all I say there. Um, second gen. American, Scot Scot Scottish American. We'll go with that. Um, but I was just trying. The first time I, I have bought a couple where, like, one or two pages in the front had been torn out when I got it. And this was that last one that I said, if anything is wrong with this journal, I'm, I, I just quit. I'm not buying used, the used one, used in very good condition. This one was like new. Anywhere you see collage, I am covering up the original owner's artwork because they had it set up. So they had already had it set up and then went, no, I think I'll send it back. I mean, I'm not talking just, this is my word of the year. Uh, I'm not talking just penciled in. I used, can you see it? Yeah. Right here, there's a bunch of white out. There, it sh whoever did it chose a bumblebee scene. So there were bees and flowers and the little dots for showing where the bee was going. And seriously, everywhere that I put collage, there is something that I'm covering up. That's my title page. Again, everywhere, see this is my focus page, everywhere there is collage, I'm covering something up. Do you see how many pages I had to cover up? That might be the last one. Yeah, I'm just going to ignore my kid over there. Monthly spread. Oh, no, look. More collage. Okay, there were only three days that first week. But seriously, this is page 13. 13 pages in, you go, oh, I'm kind of tired. I'll just send my book back. I'm, I'm just... And then Amazon sells it as a like-new... I'm like, okay, I do tip-ins. This was when I had planner piece. So I still, the five-point journaling, I love the five-point journaling. I just cannot remember exactly where I picked it up from. It was a planner, what is it called? I want to say seminar, but it was like five days of planner speakers with free gifts and stuff. And that's what that is. Tippins. Let's see. I do stickers here and there. What? What is your problem? What do you see out the window that you have to yell at? I think he's talking to me. Between cats and child. Oh my goodness. Let's see. 
that is a piece of collage. I wonder why the ribbon is there. And see if you can see where the book is beginning to come apart. Uh, it started to come apart that week and I couldn't figure out if it was something that I had done because all I had done was, you know, put my dates and, and the washi tape in. So I didn't know if it was me or if it had come from whoever had it before me. And see, just tipping things in. Stickers. Don't ask me where I get all this stuff. I don't know. I know we had a big pack of stickers from Amazon. And I would probably say something like that is from Simply Gilded. From the old subscription box, because I have a ton of that I've never used. Why? Because I love it. And I've been hoarding it, so I finally decided, no, no, we are going to have to use that. And this is what most of my bullet journals look like. It's it's actually very neat. I was going to say, tip in. I miss my tip ins. Let's see. Now you can really see how it's starting to come apart. And this is a very well made journal. That was the thing, as I know. My August journal is doing something similar, but hold on. Okay, see? You can close that book. I mean, it's just open just a little bit versus my August book, which it's so full of collage, you, you can't. So when this one started to get cranky, let's see if I can find some of it. Because even that's just gold glitter in the in the cracks. Let's see. No, you can't even tell. Because I thought some of this was coming apart. And it's really, really not. And for all this stuff I put in it. Wow. No, I don't remember what page I was on. But it's, it's the same throughout. When I do reflection, I like to have a bullet point and then write the question in one color and the answer in another. There's more um, white out. So that means something was there. Mm, Henry died in July. That's right. He's a guinea pig. Don't get upset. I mean, yes, we were upset, but don't like, no, it wasn't one of my children or anything. I love little mushrooms. And it's really... My son drew this for me. <laughs> we went to Joanne's. We went to Joanne's. I mean, if you look at it, you can tell what it is. We were buying fabric, and he kept the little pull tabs up for the number. And when we were in the car, he has a pack of crayons, and he doodled all over it for me and made art for me. So I had to put it in my planner, although I haven't secured it because I haven't figured out how. And see, as it gets down to the end of the month, less and less gets done. <laughs> oh. And as you can see, I did not... I almost never do the end of the week check-ins for the last week. And the end of the month reviews. Ugh. No. For some reason, I don't. But I'm going... I'm trying to work on that. I seriously am. And then we have just notes. Full Moon and Capricorn. All sorts of things here. August to-dos. Um, I do have an end of journal review and the only real reason that I have so much written here is because I wrote it through the month. So that was the stuff that I tried in this journal and most of it I hated. <laughs> and the pen test pages. I love, well, it would help if I showed you the pen test pages, but I love that it came with pen test pages and mostly what I did was stick random bits of washi tape. I had nowhere else to stick on it, so I already know what works. And see, I did not realize that the dual brush Tombow was different, excuse me, from the 
from these. These are the ABT Pro Alcohol Based. Okay, now I know. I, that's the first time I actually sat and read and went, oh, it's alcohol based because the dual brush from Tombo is water based. No wonder these go straight through anything. <laughs> it's like, but, 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 but I use them in my art and it's fine. Yeah. Watercolor paper and planner paper are two different things. So that's my walkthrough of July. And my August one is coming. And I think that is it, isn't it? 